There is nothing quite like match day inside a football stadium, especially when there's so much on the line. The build-up has been intense, and now we just can't wait for us all to begin. It's anyone's guess, though, which team will come out on top in front of a packed house. Stay tuned, it's live. As follows, number one, James Shane. And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. My name is Derek Ray and ready with his tactics board to provide all the analysis is Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It's Luton Town versus Wolverhampton Wanderers. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game and who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. Pablo Sarabia, Cunha, and a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. And giving them too much space on the flank, can he finish? Oh, such an elegant finish! How about that on the volley? A brilliant strike, whatever way you look at it. Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box, begging players to attack it, but the keeper should do better at his near post. That's gone in far too easily. That's not good goalkeeping. Back in action then. A wake-up call for Wolves, perhaps. Can they find a response? Lemina Pedro Neto and on the ball Sarabia Mateus Cunha Cunha he's in behind oh there it is a back and forth sort of match now they're level again the lead lasted nearly minutes well, just look at how poor the defending is here. But I have to say, it's still a very tidy finish. He looked really assured there. So back underway, following the equaliser. Campbell. Clark. Great strong tackle, throw in forthcoming. Campbell, and strong play here. Firing it in, and able to close down the shot. Played over, and the danger still on. Crucial piece of defending. Pablo Sarabia. Lemina. Can they forge ahead? And you've got to credit that magnificent piece of defending. This is a message for all away supporters. Can you please remain seated after the game and your coach will meet you at the turn. Lock you. Thank you. And take it away. Mateus Nunes. 
The delivery towards the back post. Oh, tremendous header that time. But the goalkeeper was there. Well, Wolves should have taken the lead. But what a great save by the goalkeeper that was. Plenty of space for Wolves out wide. Well, sitting deep like this might be a dangerous game. Can he finish? Well, the goalkeeper making a big contribution and denying him another one. Well, it's another chance for him. As you said, he looks so hungry for goals today. It's a short corner. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. And they'll get ready for the throw-in. A oh, quick thinking to win it back. And foul it is then. Cabore. Now they stopped them in their tracks. Pablo Sarabia. And here's Cunha. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. Lemina. Pressure applied. Can they make something of it? It's gone in! And well, he might celebrate on the back of that. Well, as you can see, he hits this with so much power. But just look at the follow through. So athletic. That's a dynamic strike. That is that for the first half here. We certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, I'm sure the manager will be delighted with him. He'll have drilled it into them to keep their focus, keep playing through to the half-time whistle, and it's certainly put them in a good position to go on and win this now. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Pablo Sarabia. Really getting stuck in. Pablo Sarabia. And possession given away. Could be threatening. Oh, so close to opening up the defence. Jose Sa. Well, the scoreline means they can focus on keeping possession. Mateus Cunha. Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. Can't really allow runs like that. Sarabia. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Kelly Rodikampanzu. There's determination there for all to see. Well, sadly, they just couldn't keep possession. Nunes. 
Well, he has the measure of his opponent. But a good piece of tidying up. Cabore. Clark. All possibilities inside the box. Just not testing the keeper at all with that cross. And the cross comes to nothing in the end. Trying his luck. Easy meet for the goalkeeper. And teammates around him. A wonderful intervention. And quite simply, wide of the target. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Now we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Well, these fans are right behind the team here. Can they get the equaliser, though? Showing patience as well as persistence in the build-up. Mateus Cunha. And Wolves being afforded too much space here. No possibilities in the centre. Fine build-up. The... Can he finish? And he's kept it out, fully stretched, somehow reaching it. And they are committed to making the substitution here. Short corner favoured. Lemina and just narrowly wide in the end And so into the final five minutes. Mateus Cunha. It looks promising. Sarabia. Oh, it's in! And that might be the goal that clinches it for them. No looking back now, surely. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a really nice ball to put him through. The vision to set up the chance is outstanding, and when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. So back underway, 3-1 the score. 21, Pablo Sarabia. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have three extra minutes. Madzuel Anderson. Kelly Ruddick and Panzu. Well, they have it again. Well, that'll be a free kick. Well, that could be the final warning. Well, he needs to be careful now. Next foul, and it's a card. That's a good ball. And that is the end of the game. It goes into the history books as a home defeat.
You're absolutely right, Derek. They really struggle to get to grips with the game. They always seem second to the ball, and then just a few mistakes at the back, and it's cost them. Poor performance all round. Well, in typical fashion, Pablo Sarabia served his team well. What did you make of what you saw from him? Well, I have to say, that was impressive. Not just his goals, but his all-round play. He was excellent.